Okay, review tayo for your coming civil service exam. An age problem pong tuturo ko sa inyo dahil marami pong ganitong lumalabas at marami pa rin po ang nalilito po dito. At ituturo ko sa inyo kung ano po yung technique para makuha yung sagot ng mabilisan. Dahil when it comes to exam, oras po ang ating kalaban. Okay, so let's analyze and solve this problem. A father said to his son, I was as old as you are at present at the time of your birth. If the father's age is 56 years now, the son's age 7 years back was... So, ito po yung question. The question is, ilang taon daw yung anak niya? Okay, so let's analyze the problem. Ang given lang natin dito ay yung edad ni tatay. Okay. At ang sabi niya, I was as old as you are at present at the time of your birth. Okay, so hanapin po natin yung age nung kanyang anak. So let X, dahil missing yan, let X the age of the son. So si tatay daw ay 56 years ngayon. Okay? At ang sabi niya dito, I was as old as you are. Meaning, the difference of the father's age now, which is 56, i-minus natin yung age nung kanyang anak, yun daw yung present age nung kanyang anak. Okay? So, ito po yung equation natin. So, 56, since ito, minus magiging positive dito, is equal to x plus x. So, 56 equal to 2x. Okay? Dahil meron po yung 1. Para makuha po natin yung age nung kanyang anak, i-divide lang po natin into 2. Okay? Para makancel po yung 2 at maiwan po yung x. So, 56 divided by 2 is equal to 28. Is equal to x. Ito po yung edad ng kanyang anak. But the question is, the son's age 7 years back. So, ang gagawin nyo lang po dito sa 28, i-deduct nyo lang po yung 7. So, 28 minus 7 is equal to 21. Kasi ang question dito, if the father's age is 56 years now, the son's age 7 years back. Kaya the answer is 21. Letter C. Okay? I hope you got this one. At pag mga itong problem, try to analyze bago po natin ito sagutan. Follow for more tips, updates, and tutorials for your coming exam. God bless!